Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about your Caesar Switch Magic Keyboard is not working on your M1 MacBook Pro. On your M1 MacBook Pro, people are making a lot of community posts about their keyboard and now mysteriously the problems are different. Some say their keyboard working on its own, some people say they don't work properly, and also they're complaining their slowness and unresponsiveness about their keyboard. Now, no matter what type of problem you're having with your MacBook Pro with Amon Chip, just stay tuned with this video if you want to solve it, okay? Now, before we go ahead and show you the main process, let me tell you why this happens. First up, this problem can happen dust and other contaminates, and incorrect software settings, problematic apps, bugs and glitches, and broken hardwares. Now to solve your problem, now the first things we want you to do is just go ahead and refresh your keyboard. Now the question is, how can you even refresh your keyboard? If you want to refresh it, first place you want to go, just go ahead and click on your spotlight search and then type activity monitor. And then you're going to see this application here. You go ahead and click on this application from here, from your activity monitor, and click on the CPU, and now type keyboard. Now here, you're going to find out a keyboard option here. Just go ahead and click that on, and now click sample. Now here, first of all, click refresh. And afterward, check whether your keyboard is now being able to work properly or not. And if you see still you're having the problem, then simply go ahead and click on quit and click quit and simply close this uh, pop-up window from here. Click on your Apple logo, come down here and click restart. Click restart from the pop-up and your MacBook Pro is going to be get a restart and afterward your problem should be solved. Alright guys, if the first process didn't work for your M1 Caesar Switch Magic Keyboard, the next things we're going to go ahead and talk about is the keyboard itself. Now if you navigate to this uh, Apple logo here, come down to your system preference and down here you're going to see the keyboard option. Click on there and now the first things we're going to be saying is the key repeat, okay? Especially if you don't get the fast response as soon as you just press the keys, you have to make this uh, key repeat fast or you can just change the delay until repeat in the middle, okay? And at the same time, you have to come down here, especially to the press tool, just click on there and simply change to your input source. After doing this, now click on the shortcut, just go ahead and click on restore default, especially if you have changed anything whatsoever. Now afterward, go ahead and check whether your keyboard is working properly or not. If it doesn't, go ahead and check out the next way to solve your problem. And the next things you gotta do, just go ahead and click on your Apple logo and come down here and click on this system preference and right afterward, just choose your accessibility. From your accessibility, come down here and choose your keyboard. Make sure to disable that streaky keys from here, okay? Now once you have just unmarked them, now afterward just go ahead and open up your notes and check whether your keyboard is now working or not. Well, even afterward, if you're still having the same problem, go ahead and check out the next way to solve your problem. Okay everybody, now after changing your settings, if you're still experiencing the same issue with your M1 MacBook Pro, the next thing we're going to go ahead and recommend you to do is to just clean your keyboard. If there's a lot of dust in particles stuck on your keyboards, this problem can happen. So now simply clean this up and give it a check one more time whether now your keyboard is working well or not. Even after cleaning your keyboard, if you're still experiencing the same problem, the next recommendable tips is for you. You either can choose that virtual keyboard on your M1 Mac or you can choose a wireless keyboard that you can literally use on your M1 Mac. Now if you want to turn on that uh, virtual keyboard on your M1 Mac, the first place you want to go is the Apple logo, come down to your system preference and then come down to your accessibility and then search and find out your keyboard options and click accessibility keyboard now go ahead and click enable accessibility keyboard and you will be able to see the keyboard will appear on your screen which is so called the virtual keyboard okay you can either use it or you can simply you know go to your apple logo and come down to your system preference and then you can click on our keyboard and then let me just cut this off and then you can click on here set up a completed keyboard you can click here it will be able to show you any wireless keyboard if it's available with you right now 
Well, using that virtual keyboard or wireless keyboard can be the temporary solution. But if you're experiencing the hardware related issues with your Caesar Switch Magic Keyboard, then you gotta go to the Apple Care to solve your problem. Alright, guys, so these are the ways you guys can follow in order to solve your Caesar Switch Magic Keyboard if it's not working on your M1 MacBook Pro. Hope you find this video useful. If so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you later.